Hello you lovely people, welcome back to my channel for another SNK Neo Geo video guys. But yeah, this one is not just for the AES like all my other videos have been guys. No, this is one title and it is a bit of a historical title guys as well. Yeah, it really has a mark there in video game history. Um, it is League Bowling. Now... Why is this historically significant, guys? Well, up until SNK developed and released this little beauty, guys, we hadn't had a bowling game in the arcades. So, yeah, that is why it's a little bit historically significant, because in 1990, they took the plunge and finally brought a bowling game, solely bowling, to the arcades, guys. So yeah, it was released in 1990 onto arcades, and that is why it is significantly important in video game history. Now, they did bring it to the AES in 1991, and it reached the CD in North America, guys, the Neo Geo CD, um, in 96. Although it was released a lot earlier in Japan onto the CD, guys, in 94. So this has had quite a bit of a a run guys hasn't it um with different dates there but initially and historically important the first bowling game went into arcades yeah in 1990 guys so yeah what a fantastic game this is as well it's gorgeous now i've never had the joy of playing this arcade and i'll tell you what right there's there's um i mean if you're in the uk you will know this holiday camp place guys this this holiday well everybody knows Butlins come on everybody knows Butlins it is a holiday park guys um now in Minehead from 94 yeah 94 guys to 2001 they had this arcade along with King King of Fighters and something else guys they had them there right up until 2001 so yeah quite incredible uh, they were here for that long guys and a lot of people will have probably played them in that time. So yeah, over here in the UK, you may well have heard of it if you went to Butlins in Minehead, guys. So yeah, absolutely fantastic. Now, um, you can play as uh, this different coloured haired character. Um, the one I'm going to choose is blue haired. Uh, you can also go for red, I do believe. And you get to choose the weight of your ball. Uh, between uh, £8 and, uh, I do believe, £15. Um, is it pound? Let's have a look. Yeah, pounds, guys. I had to check there quick because I wasn't too sure. But yeah, £8 and £15. So yeah, so that depends on what weight you're going to be chucking along there. Now, it's your usual bowling game, guys, just with absolutely fantastic flipping graphics, guys. Oh, my God, are the graphics gorgeous on this. They are absolutely stunning. Now, if you look in the background, there's a little bit of an Easter egg. And I'm just going to scroll down again here uh, and have a look. Where was it? Uh, da, da, da. Here we go. Yeah, because in the back, if you know your Japanese Ami, then you may know uh, Nadia. Now, she does a cameo in the background, guys. Uh, she's there cheering with the rest of them. And it's Nadia from The Secret of Blue Water. So a little Easter egg there, guys, in the background. So, yeah, this is a very interesting title. Just the one, as I say. But yeah, would you like to join me as we take a look at something that is by SNK again for the Neo Geo Arcade, AES, and Neo Geo CD. Um, fantastic, guys. Absolutely gorgeous looking and very, very fun to play. So yeah, guys, hold on to your britches, because this is a stunner and historically significant for being the first bloody bowling game on an arcade. Right, back in a sec. 
Right, here we go guys, we're one title. But a fantastic one. If you like your bowling games. Demo. Wicked looking, isn't it? Absolutely wicked looking. Yep, let's play this thing, shall we? One player, absolutely. Regulations, oh, whatever. Yeah, it'll do. Let's bowl. Now, like I said, guys, this is a bowling game and a half. Ah, uh, no! <laughs> what a load of rubbish, eh? Um, yes, that's better. Yay! Yeah, and again. Fantastic. It's about the best I've done on a bowling game in ages. Not so good that time. Oh dear. <laughs> Yes, that's better. That wasn't too bad. Not bad at all. Yeah, look at him flexing his muscles. But now, what are we going to get now? Oh, you bugger. Oh. Fantastic graphics, though, isn't it? Go for it, come on. Oh, not brilliant, but all right. Go for it, come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh no, yes. Oh, one still standing, bugger. That's not going to do Jack. Ah, uh, sure your crappy can be. Well, hey, that's better. I like that. What score did I get this time, though? Right? Well, that do nothing again. Oh dear. <sighs> Throw it hard. We should get something. Right, wait for it. No, I knew that was going to go wrong. Damn. Got to get it in that middle. That's it. Go for it. See what happens now. Yes. Nice one. At least I've got a, uh, a strike again. Let me get this time. Nearly. Oh, just one, guys. Just one. Can we get it? Yeah. There we go. That's fine. <laughs> this cheese is going. Brilliant. What can we get with this one? Nothing. It's going to be better. Oh dear. Yeah, come on, come on, get something. Oh, I'm too hot, but no. Oh. Right, here we go, that is the scores. Alright, okay. The amount of different players you can have here. Hmm. Game of that. Okay. First place, well, yeah, of course I will be. I'm playing on my Todd. Alright. Plank. Ah. 
do like the graphics, though they're fantastic here guys, these are wonderful, what a flipping awesome, blinking, that game, yeah, blinking awesome, right, let's try a different, uh, let's try a different player, see if any different people, there we go, let's go for it, ha, <laughs> I love that, that is wicked guys, wicked, Right, here we go, we shall go straight in there this time. So yeah, one player. Okay, let's go for Flash this time, shall we? See what difference it makes. Alright, oh, okay, so you can't change player, but you can go for this, right, okay. Let's see what difference this makes, eh? See. Yeah, that wasn't too bad, was it? Not too bad, guys. What's that gonna do? Get it, get it, get it, get it, come on, get it. No! Oh, you bugger. Oh well. Go for it. <sighs> that was crap. Are I gonna achieve anything? No, nothing whatsoever. How about that? No, still too far over. <laughs> oh, that's just pure sad. Oh. Yeah, that's a bit better. Just two standing. Can you get them quickly? No. Oh. No. Too early. Go for it, let's see. Come on, come on. Yes. Let's strike. That's too far over. I'm not already. Yeah, just not one over. Oh, crap. That'll be good. Come on. Better be. No, oh, just a couple again. Oh, dear. They're not doing so well this time, guys, are they? Let's see what this will bring. Oh, I think it's too far over again. See what I'll do. Two left. Oh dear. It's too far over again. Yeah. Okay. Straight in the middle and as fast as possible, hard as possible. That's what you want. But I'm not achieving it. What an awesome bloody game that is. Awesome. Yeah, this is not good. Oh, just two left. Did I get, no, I didn't get either of them. Oh. Yeah, that wasn't good, guys. <laughs> I'm still first place because it's only me playing, of course. How hilarious is that? Right. <laughs> yeah, that is, that is hilarious. That was Flash. Very interesting. Hmm. Right, let's see what else we can do here. Then. <laughs> Keep reading it up, folks. It's brilliant. Right. There we go. Let's see. Let's again, uh, let's have a look, go down to Spike, 90, right, okay, let's stick with that, yeah, let's see what that does, ooh, not too bad, how about that, no, too far over, damn it, Ooh, yeah, strike, wicked. Wicked, wicked, wicked. Ah, bugger. Did that get me in there? No, it didn't. 
What a surprise, eh? Let's try again. Yay! Good one. Oh, he just throws it if you wait too long. Damn it. <laughs> oh, look at that with that puff. That was hilarious. Okay, just one standing. What do you think? Hmm. It's tremendous fun. I've got to do it like that. It is really, really fun. It's a fun game. I wish I was getting a few more stars. Come on. Oh, one left. No, I knew that was going to go on the bottom. I knew it. I'm just trying to get a, a judge for it. Go for it, come on. Oh, nearly, nearly. It's so simple as well, you know, just a... No! <laughs> So simple, but you just got to master it, guys, to get it in the middle and then as fast as possible. You know, I'm, I'm doing crap again. Oh dear. Alright, let's see what happens here. Oh, still some standing. At least you have seen me do a few strikes. Ah, terrible. Oh dear. Game set, I'll be the winner again. Yeah. Of course. <laughs> You're only playing against yourself, what's it gonna be, eh? Of course it's gonna be you are the winner. Dear me, eh? Right. There we go. See if there's anything we've missed. What a fantastic bowling game, though. Know? Imagine playing this stuff in the arcade or something. Wow, that would be awesome, awesome. Right, let's see. Let's go for two players, shall we? Come on. No, it won't really matter, guys. Oh, well, we have realised that there's a, you know, there isn't two players here, so, yeah. Uh, let's go for regulation again. Is there anything else we can change here? Ooh, look at that. Ooh. Okay, let's go for 11 then, yeah. See what difference that makes. Got a pink ball. <coughs> well, it's literally just the colour of the ball, isn't it? I think so. Did I get more? No, still one there. Let's see what that does. Anything? No, it's still in the gutter again. Yes, yes, I know you wind up. Go for it. Come on, you got to get something. Yeah, we nearly. There's one standing. Oh. One again. Come on. Yeah, that's it, we got it. Yeah, at least he's happy. I love the, I love the graphics at the top there with him. Wicked. Right, we've got always oh, having some to eat, okay. Using up a lot of energy there, he needs to build himself up, of course. Poor little bugger. And wee! One standing again, I can't believe it, guys. Can't believe it. Oh, oh, it's just getting worse. <laughs> Can I do anything there? No, I didn't think so somewhere. Bloody hell, eh? That's it, go for it. No. In the gutter. <laughs> I like it up at the top again, the animation again. Come on, give me a strike. Oh, Seriously? Come on, I want a strike. No! Oh. 
<laughs> what a waste of time. I didn't have it anywhere near where it needed to be. Uh, still haven't. No, uh, just not one over. Oh, that'll do. Okay. Yeah, a little bit. Nothing much to write home about though. What are we gonna do now? Oh it's getting that middle bit guys. Oh, still too standing. Oh. No, yeah. just not going to get my strike this time, guys. Hmm. Hmm. Yep, didn't get my strike, but no doubt, I've won again. Yeah, look at that, I've won again, guys. But yeah, what a fantastic look. Had a brilliant, brilliant bowling game for the Neo Geo AES. Right, back with my final four. Told you it was awesome, didn't I? Absolutely awesome. Did you see Nadia in the background though? Comment below, did you spot her? Um, yeah, that little Easter egg, guys, fantastic. So, to just look out for it once you know it's there, guys. Um, but yeah, fantastic bloody bowling game, guys. And wow, for it to be the first one that hit the arcades is awesome because that is a gorgeous bloody bowling game. Um, yeah, oh, League Bowling, guys, is fantastic. I love it already where you can choose the hair colour of the character. You can go between blue and red. Obviously, I didn't. I stuck with the same colour. Um, you can choose the weight of the ball between £8 and £15. That is brilliant as well. And then it has the same old usual flaw of a bowling game, doesn't it? Where you, you're waiting for that metre to go across. Uh, and you want to hit it in the middle, preferably, and as hard as possible. Um, and then sometimes you need it a bit more gentle to get the side ones and what have you. I played it crap as usual. What else do you expect? It's me. It's going to happen. Um, but yeah, oh my god. The graphics are fantastic. You, you really wouldn't believe that that is a 1990 game, guys. So early on. And uh, the music's fantastic. It has a bit of wit to it. Um, I absolutely love this. I love bowling games anyway when they're done well, and this is done awesomely. This is SNK at their best again. And, you know, they, they did develop it and release it themselves, and it bloody shows. It really does. They put a lot of love into this game. And I just find it absolutely fascinating, the history of this game, guys, that it was the first bowling game onto arcades. That Minehead, Butlins, had this machine in their camp guys in their their holiday park sorry i keep calling it a bloody camp holiday park it makes you think there's all tents and stuff anyway it's holiday park guys and that they had it from 94 to 2001 so there's been a hell of a lot of people experienced this machine over here in blighty which is fantastic absolutely fantastic um yeah i i just cannot highly recommend this game enough guys like i said though it was released arcade uh, aes and then onto the CD and all these different time frames, guys. Obviously, Arcade 1990, the AES 91, and that was Japan, North America, and Europe. And then it went onto the CD in only Japan and, uh, you know, in 94, and then into North America. <sighs> 96, guys, we never got it here in Europe on the CD, but then the CD had no presence here whatsoever, really. So. You were lucky to get anything on the uh, Neo Geo CD here. But yeah, fantastic. Even with that, guys, all these lovely, lovely bloody ways of playing it. And of course, this is also an emulation video because I didn't tell you earlier, I did play this once again on the GPD XD Plus. Um, so yeah, fantastically emulated once again by that doozy of a little handheld, guys. My God, is that a stunner of a handheld. It just bangs them out, guys. It's just oh, barely anything you can throw at it that it doesn't handle. And that was another prime example of it beautifully handled again. So, yeah. Oh, wow. Another fantastic title by SNK for the Neo Geo Arcade, AES, and Neo Geo CD. Wow. All right, there you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed that one. Let me know. What did you think of it? You might not be a big fan of bowling games like I am. Not everybody is. It's, uh, you know, 
It's a Marmite type of game, that's for sure. Um, but I certainly had a doozy replaying it. So yes, guys, let me know in the comments what you think. And with that, I'm going to say the usuals. If you're not subbed already, please drop me a sub. Give me a funny thumbs up if you feel that way inclined. And of course, don't forget to tap the bell icon and the all icon to get any notifications whatsoever. And like I was saying there, guys, about emulation, do you love emulation? Because if you do, I've got the linking group for you on Facebook. It's the Retro Emulation Fan Group, guys. That me and my best friend Nate set up quite some time ago now, guys. We now have a fantastic dedicated admin team who are just brilliant. And they cover America, the UK and Australia for time zones guys there will always be somebody there to answer your questions if you need tech help or anything like that or just a banter with us and then of course we've got tons of members it's getting bigger and bigger by the minute so lots of like-minded emulation enthusiasts now the best thing is there's tons of videos guys absolute tons of videos whether it's system reviews on your handhelds or your home systems whatever like your Pandoras and god knows what else um, your pies and there is also tech videos for any kind of tech help there is videos on the uh, custom firmwares you can drop onto the handhelds there is just a ton of content there for you to go and watch and like i said guys come over and have a banter with the rest of us so yeah if you love emulation head over to facebook look up the retro emulation fan group and uh, yeah join us we will welcome you with open arms. And then, guys, I also have my UK Kraut Gaming Facebook page as well, guys. We cover everything from retro to modern. So, like, from your Pong machines to your PS5s. Anything goes there, as long as it's gaming. And again, guys, tons of videos for you to watch, because lots of other YouTubers put their videos up there as well. So, it's fantastic for content again. And again, guys... Just come there if you love gaming and have a banter with all the other members. Again, it's growing all the time. So yeah, if you love gaming, just in general, head over to Facebook. Look up UK Crap Gaming, all lowercase. Ask to join and I will accept you in no time. And then finally, guys, I have a Patreon. It is linked below. Head over to Patreon. I have a video there, guys, that I made a long time ago now guys explaining why i decided to set up my patreon account and uh, yeah give it a watch guys and then see if you maybe want to join me on my patreon journey and with that i'm going to love you and leave you and i'm going to say off in juice and goodbye and i'll see you in the next one bye bye guys